you, darling. <laughs> Thank you. I knew that you would appreciate the finer things of life. After all, you are Burl's audience. <laughs> well, I tell you, this, this was my audience, too. It was my audience, but now they're yours. I like that idea. You were great, really great. No, yes, I know, darling. Yeah? The only time I'm not great is when I'm uh, magnificent. <laughs> you know, Tallulah, I've never seen you look so lovely, Tallulah, especially... That's a beautiful gown. Yes, it is rather charming, isn't it? Mm -hmm. My dear little dressmaker was up all night. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sewing? And no, he has sinus trouble. <laughs> No, but I really do hope for his sake that I'm picked as the best-dressed woman of the year. Well, that's a great honor, because I know I, I won it in 1948. <laughs> but don't laugh. I, on the Texaco show, I had this one dress with a peekaboo motif. It was Cerise. And it had this <laughs> long, swirling skirt made out of... Well, you can see it yourself. This Sunday night, Loretta Young is wearing it. <laughs> you love her. You love her. Oh, I do love her. Dear spinning Loretta, <laughs> I must send her some Dramamine. Tallulah, you know, it's sure good having you on my program again. Well, I must say that it's wonderful having a Milton Burl hour on television again. No, I, don't, I don't think you got that right. I'm only on for a half hour. And uh, not when you're watching it, darling. <laughs> uh, Tallulah, you got a great delivery. Where'd you park your truck? Laugh it up, folks. <laughs> I think these are the jokes. You think these are the jokes? <laughs> and to think, mm. if a little less money, I could have stayed home watching the most <laughs> divine motion picture on television. Really? Who's in it? Me! <laughs> Wait, figured. Who else could hold your interest? <laughs> I know the picture that you mean, uh, Lifeboat. Uh -huh. It was great, really was great. Oh, I'll never forget it. I was the only woman shipwrecked in a lifeboat with ten men. Really? But it had a very, very sad ending. Sad? Yes, I was rescued. <laughs> you know, Tallulah, most comedians with live shows find themselves competing with their own movies on television, but I, I don't seem to have that problem. I know, I know. Your pictures are the only ones showing on radio. <laughs> Didn't I see you shave on the cavalcade of sports? <laughs> Didn't I, darling? Isn't he sweet? <laughs> I must send a care package to his brain. Very funny. Very funny. If I were you, Tallulah, and sometimes I am... <laughs> I spend less time talking and more time gargling. I am... No, I'm only kidding. I'm only... T Tallulah and I are great friends. Of course we are, but not each other's. I have a very good answer for that, but I have too much respect for her to use it. After all, Tallulah Bankhead is one of the great personalities of our time. She's been a dazzling star for many, 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 many years. <laughs> One minute would have been quite sufficient. <laughs> Tulula, I know that you won't mind if I tell our viewers and uh, the audience uh, that you are 41. I don't mind at all. Getting there was half the fun. <laughs> Tulula and I have certainly come a long way. Yes, and you are to be particularly commended, Milton. Thank you very much. Because you started from so much farther back. <laughs> Folks, be sure and buy a Tulula Bankhead doll. That's the kind that sticks pins in you. <laughs> Tallulah, I'll never forget the first time that we met. I'll never forget it. You were a big star when we were first introduced. Tallulah was in Paris, wasn't it? No, darling, it was in New York. Oh, that's right. You were in the show uh, Skin of a Teeth? No, no, The Little Foxes. Oh, that's right, yeah. Oh, and you and Earl Carroll's vanity. No, I wasn't Earl Carroll. I was Zigfield Folly. Ah, oh, that's right. <laughs> and you do remember, huh? I remember distinctly, Milton, darling. Remember the first date we had, Tallulah? I remember, do you? We met at nine. We met at eight. I was on time. No, you were late. Ah, uh, yes, I remember it well. We dined with friends. Uh, we dined alone. A tenor sang. A baritone. Ah, uh, yes, I remember it well. That dazzling April moon. You that was blue. 
And the month was June. And the month was June. That's right, that's right. It warms my heart to know that you, how much you do, remember still the way you do. Ah, yes, dear. I remember it well. Hello? How often I've thought of that Friday. Monday. Night. When we had our last rendezvous, and somehow I foolishly wondered if you might, by some chance, be thinking of it too. That carriage ride. Uh, you walked me home. You lost a glove. I lost a comb. Ah, yes, I remember it well. That brilliant sky. And we had some rain. Those Russian songs. From sunny Spain. <laughs> yes, I remember it well. You wore a gown of gold. I was all in blue. Am I getting old? Oh, no, not you. How strong you were, how light and gay, a prince of love in every way. Ah, yes, I remember it well. <laughs> <laughs> 